it's Keegan welcome back to my channel so today we are going to be doing a huge try on back to school clothing haul kind of thing lots of words going on here I asked you guys on Twitter which by the way if you're not following me on Twitter go follow me I feel like I tweet relatable things but like they're probably just relatable to me just kidding I really I really don't I, re I don't I where am I going with this anyways I asked you guys in a poll I do a ton of polls on Twitter for videos and upcoming uh, future <laughs> things <laughs> so in the poll I asked if you wanted a super long haul or if you wanted it two separate ones and you guys had a super long haul so get a snack going it's gonna be a long video Maybe pull up another page in an online shop while I show you all my clothes that I got maybe go follow me on Instagram <laughs> the amount of shameless self promo but I mean I spent a really long time trying to make my theme look good so just like go follow me I'll like boost my self-confidence or whatever and before we actually start this video I know this intro is so so long but I'm doing a huge giveaway going on right now it's actually ending super soon so don't forget to enter I'll have the video linked down below and to the card section and there's two prizes of so two winners I just got a snapchat mm -hmm. it's ending so soon so don't forget to enter you'd be crazy not to enter there's some really awesome prizes so I'm going to get started with the haul before I get started with the haul I need to tell you a backstory so just kidding we're not getting started with the haul if you follow me on snapchat you know that I ordered a ton of stuff from Romway Romway I'm gonna call it Romway because I feel like that's like the right way to say it I ordered a ton of stuff and if you don't know what that website is it's like kind of like a sketchy website from China they're always in the ads like not that they're sketchy but like you just I really know what you're getting when you're ordering stuff from China. They actually asked me to do a video with them a while ago and I was like, no thank you. I didn't want to be locked into a contract where I had to say nice things about a company or a brand or a t-shirt that I didn't love, so I obviously did not do that. So everything that I bought here, my own money, no company sent any of this to me, no company knows I am doing any of this. It's all me. I think I got 29 shirts for $205 and I realized that I could have saved 10 more dollars if I used a different promo code, but I think that's really awesome. I was kind of scared to get the clothes because I was like, what if they don't fit? What if they take forever to ship. They didn't take that long to ship. I was really surprised. I'm actually really impressed with it. Once again, they have no idea I'm filming this video. I'm not doing this for money or like anything at all. But I'm just going to get started with the clothes. The first one here, this is the only one that I find is uncomfortable to wear. It's like itchy when I wear it, but it's this really pretty like periwinkle peplum top. And then the sleeves, they kind of like go in and then it has like this floral pattern. I think it's really cute. I was planning on wearing it on the first day of school, but I don't know if I will or not just because it's so like itchy. Like the flowers just kind of make it itchy wearing it and it's when I put it on I'm like I want to take this off. I really love peplum tops. If you guys see in this video there's so many peplum tops. I definitely have a very like girly kind of blowy style. Maybe one day that will change and I'll be like super edgy and cool. As of right now not really. Did I mention that all this stuff is wrong way? I think I did. I think just just in case in case we forgot wrong way. I got a ton of t-shirts because I felt like you couldn't really go wrong with t-shirts like there's no way of messing them up. So I didn't get dresses or shorts or anything. Let me know if you guys want me to do another video where I try more stuff from there. This one is a kind of like mom sweater shirt and it has like these kind of holes by the shoulder I don't really know I don't know how to describe it the only thing I don't like about it is these things right here they're a little bit longer than my shoulders are they kind of like sag over but I like it it's very thick it's not like not soft but it's also not soft at the same time like it's not uncomfortable it's not soft it's just like a normal fabric I was really afraid these would be super uncomfortable and not fit just because like you get what you pay for and I didn't really pay that much for these but I'm just overall really impressed this one my mom really likes and I'm not really sure how I feel about it because I kind of feel like it restricts my movement like going like this but it's a really pretty kind of like white and navy floral shirt and then has some lace at the sleeves and at the bottom there are some like strings hanging from it but like it's a five dollar shirt I kind of expect it to be like that I'll try to put the prices of all these if I can remember to do that next one you guys have seen this in a video and you guys said this is really great for my eye color it's this crop top that is white and has like this kind of royal blue embroidery not embroidery like print on it it really reminds me of China not like black China like Robert Card Kardashian's like ex-wife girlfriend thing that like went all crazy and everything. Was it not clothing? Like the glasses, like you know, like the really fancy stuff that your parents are like, no, you're not allowed to have this, you're gonna break it. So I really like this. It's cropped. I think you can totally like dress this up and make it look super fancy. So I really like that. This next one is so so soft. It's a color block t-shirt. So on top it's white and on the bottom it's like this kind of like really pretty light coral pink. I was really afraid that like the white t-shirts would be super see-through, but they're actually not. And this one is probably the softest one, and it's one of my favorites. And I really really like this one. I live in Arizona So we have a ton of cacti here and I thought this shirt was just like super cute It's kind of like this like muted pink and then it has a cute little cactus And I thought this would be super cute for like a lazy day if I maybe like tie in a little knot with some jeans or some shorts or something I just thought it was super cute. It's like stretchy 
See that? Stretchy. I can eat as much of it as I want and this shirt will give and let me eat. You know what I mean? You know those shirts that are a little tight and you eat a lot and you're like, it's not stretch. This one will stretch with me when I have a food baby. Uh-huh. This was the one that was the most expensive and it's the only one I don't like. And it's this white. It looks like a doily in all honesty. And then in the picture online, it kind of like faded to lace at the bottom. But when you try it on, it literally is just like cut straight. Like it just flat off, like cuts off and you can totally see it. It's to the point where it's so high, like high waisted jeans can't cover it. And it also has like a little thing on the inside. Do you know what I'm, do you see this what I'm talking about right here? You can see through it when you're wearing it. So it looks like I'm wearing a bib. This is the only one that I don't see myself wearing, but I feel like maybe, I don't know. I want to like it, but I just I don't. This one I wore to the Khalid concert. If you guys know the guy at the Sings location, it's him. And I actually really like this. So it is kind of like a cold shoulder top. It's really hard to show when I'm holding it up. It's really pretty. And I've never really been the biggest fan of off the shoulder tops on me just because I feel like I have man shoulders. I'm not trying to body shame myself or anything, but I feel like I know what looks good on me and what doesn't. My mom even told me that it's from like her side of the family, like we have man shoulders. So thanks to my ancestors that <laughs> have man shoulders. You guys suck, even though you're dead. Haha. <laughs> Why am I talking to my dead ancestors? Anyways, this video is getting a little weird. Anyways, I really like this and it was like kind of a stepping stone into off the shoulder tops and I really like it. I don't, I haven't seen anything like this anywhere and I just think it's really pretty. This next one online, I was like, it's either hit or miss. And I feel like I got a lot of clothes that were hit or misses because everything was so cheap. It's really pretty. It has like a longer peplum in the front and on the back it's a shorter peplum and it's vertical stripes. But I feel like it kind of looks like I'm wearing nurse scrubs so I don't really know if I like how much I'll wear it. Like I still will wear it. I just don't know. Because it kind of looks like nurse scrubs to me. <laughs> this one my mom doesn't really like. I think it's cute. It's just like a lot going on. But it's another peplum top. As you can tell I kind of like peplum tops. But it's blue and has like a ton of prints on it. This one's a little bit big for me so I think that I have to wear like jeans with it because it's so long that it would like cover me wearing shorts. I was really afraid about the sizing on runway, but I got a medium or one size fits all. I'm not awkward size in between a small and a medium. Like it really depends on the shirt or the clothing item, but I got a medium and most of them fit perfectly. Some are a little big, but nothing is too small for me. This one is really thin material. Like it reminds me of a napkin kind of, but it's this really pretty white and has like this, I don't even know what these are called, but they're like old <laughs> and they look like flowers and they're on the bottom of the sleeves. And I really like this. I think it's just really cute and feminine and girly. This one, uh, I like the color of it. Don't get me wrong. It's like a really pretty baby pink, but it ties at the bottom. Can we see how like long these ties are? Like they're so long and I just don't like, I don't really understand why they're so long. So I feel like I'm going to cut them and then maybe take a little bit of like glue or liquid stitch and like fold it over so it doesn't fray. It's a cute shirt. I just think the tie where you tie it in the front is a little too long for me. This next one, I, mm, I don't know. It's like a white t-shirt and then has like these really pretty sleeves. <laughs> it has a tie at the bottom, which I think is really cute. The only thing is there's like a little hole where the tie is and that's exactly where my belly button is and then the sleeves are really pretty but I feel like they kind of like flounce up a little bit too much like I want them to lay down and they kind of like to stick up so maybe if I iron it down it will work better this is like one that I'm not the biggest fan of okay so then I got this shirt it's a crop top and it has these cute little tassels at the bottom I thought these are super cute I'm kind of afraid to wash this just in case like all the tassels fall off but it's really cute and it's another one that's like stretchy materials that like will give with me when I eat a lot of food because your girl likes food I eat a lot of food. This one's kind of similar to it, but it has like pom-poms on it. And the reason why I got this one, because it's like this like peach color. And most of the time when I see shirts have like pom-poms is white. So I thought it was a little bit different that it was pink pop pom I don't, am I, I feel like I'm saying pom-poms wrong, but they are on the sleeves and the, uh, the bottom, bottom of the shirt. I don't know. Is that called the bottom of the shirt? Like, is there a name for like the bottom of a shirt? <laughs> I feel like this one's very like useful and childish. So I kind of like it. This one I haven't tried on yet because my head can't fit through it. So as you can see, it's like this super pretty floral top and then it has a little cutout right here which I've really been liking but this little thing right here is like sewn together. Hi editing Keegan here. I'm just here to tell you guys that I'm an idiot and that little part that is sewn together is actually a button and all I need to do to wear it is unbutton it but I'm an idiot that didn't realize that. So I think what I'm gonna do is like cut it and either save deepen them together or get some velcro because I want to wear it. I spent money on it. It's just kind of like weird how they sewed it together right here like my head can't fit through that. I mean, like, I do have a big head, but I feel like people with small heads even can't fit through it. So this top, I totally thought I was going to, like, hate in all honesty. I kind of got it just because it was cheap and I was, like, worth the shot. But I actually kind of like it. It's a boxier top. It's kind of like a button down and it has, like, this kind of peachy, not necessarily plaid, but, like, line pattern on it. And then you tie it at the very bottom. And I actually really like it. I think it's super cute. I think it looks a lot nicer on me than I thought it would. So I'm very pleased with that. And my self-esteem definitely went up when I was like, oh, I don't look like a man. I mean like I slightly look like
like a man, but not as much like a man. This one is like so cute. It's one of my favorites. The material is so nice. It's like thick, but it's not too thick. And it's like this kind of nice like muted blue striped shirt. And then it has a little tie. It's very kind of like boyish, but I really like it. I just think it's so pretty. It's one of my favorites. I definitely see myself wearing this a ton. Oh. My bra strap like falls on me all the time and my boobs are sweating and like I just am having a lot of issues right now. This one I totally thought was going to be like an oatmeal color, but it's gray, which I don't really mind. It's very big. I don't know if I got this one in a size or if it's one size fits all, but it's another peplum top. Surprise, surprise. I definitely have to wear this with jeans because it is just really long and it would definitely cover my shorts and I'd look like I'm not wearing shorts, but I really do like it. It's very nice and oversized. I wasn't really planning on it being oversized, but we roll with the punches. I literally have like a pile of clothes and it's like the leaning tower of pizza and it's like gonna fall over soon. I got another shirt with cacti on it and this one is just super cute and like playful. It's a white. My issue with Romway clothes is there's no tag on it. Like there's no like tag. This is the size. So I have no idea which way is the front and which way is the back. But it has a ton of cacti and they're like upside down and right side up and I just think it's super cute. Playful and just very fun. Another really great like lazy day kind of shirt. This is like the softest material ever. This is another bathroom top. Why do I do this myself? It's another peplum top, but it's like a really pretty like mauve pink color and it's just really pretty I would have to wear jeans with this one as well The only thing I don't like about it is the sleeves. There's like a lot of extra fabric So it kind of like flounces, which I'm not the biggest fan Why did a car just drive by my house like honking a toy? But I'm not the biggest fan of this sleeves But like it's just so pretty and very very much me. I own a lot of the same stuff This one is another white crop top and it has like this V and it kind of reminds me of like a necklace. I don't know, I feel like I can totally like dress this up and make it look super fancy and I just think it's really cute. I like me some white shirts. <laughs> Speaking of white, we have another one. This one is also a crop top and it has lace at the sleeves and the bottom of the shirt. I just think it's really girly and feminine and super cute. If you guys saw my Twitter, there was a picture of me going bowling and it totally looked like I had antlers on my head. It was really funny. But I was wearing this shirt. It's, <laughs> it's another pebble. I just think they're so cute and they flatter me really well. But it has like embroidery up here by the neckline. And the embroidery is in style. Like it's in like <laughs> it's just super in season and super cute. So I really like this top and I think it's adorable. And of course it's white. <laughs> this material reminds me of a paper napkin, but it's it's really pretty like blue color and there's scalloping on the bottom and on the sleeves. And I just feel like it's one of those tops where you can just like throw on the pair of shorts and you still look nice, but you didn't put a lot of effort into it. Okay, so I want you guys to comment how you would wear this because I have no idea how I would wear this. It was really cute online, but just like in person, I feel like it's really overwhelming. It's like this baby pink shirt and then it has these flowers on it. I think it's super cute. The only thing about it is it's just like it's a lot going on and you can't wear a necklace with it because that's like so much going on and it's too hot here for a jacket even in the winter. So comment down below how you guys would wear it. Please do. Mm, I'm so excited for this one. This is a cropped USA shirt. It's one size fits all and then it has like a little star. I wore this in my direct store high school makeup tutorial and guess what I accidentally did? I accidentally got two. I'm going to give this one away to you guys. It's in the packaging. It's one size fits all. I haven't touched it. It's just a t-shirt. I will write you guys a cute little note as well. All of the rules will be in the description on how to enter. If you guys want to be 20 with me and have a USA shirt then definitely check out the description and enter the giveaway. The reason why I got this actually was because we have a lot of spirit days and sometimes they're American themed so I just thought this would be perfect for an American themed spirit. Day. And the last thing from Romway is another another peplum top, which I've worn. I think I wore this in my 10 things I wish I knew before I went to high school, but it's really pretty. Again, I'd have to wear jeans with this one as well because it's a little long, but it has really pretty like flowers and I just think it's super cute. So that is everything that I got from Romway, Romway, whatever you want to call it. This is a shirt that I wore in my giveaway and my school supplies haul and you guys were like, Keegan, this is your color. You look great in this. It's a periwinkle top that's also a peplum top and it's just really pretty. Not necessarily the most like appropriate for school in terms of dress code My school has a dress code but like no one really follows it that much because it's super hot outside and no one really like gets dress coded so I feel like I could wear this and maybe just bring a jacket just in case But it's from a boutique called Lily's and I got it when I was in Coronado, California Yeah, you guys really telling me how much you loved me in this top so I was like, oh, thank you Thank you going on to Char- I hit myself in the face with that slightly Charlotte Russe. If you know me, I like hate shoe shopping I have no idea why but 
but I just really don't like them. But I got this cute pair of sandals. They're like brown. I don't own cute shoes because I don't like shoe shopping and I want to get some more just like really cute casual shoes that, and these ones are just really pretty. So like I said, I'm not the biggest fan of off the shoulder tops on me just because I feel like I have like very manly shoulders and they're just like broad and wide and I'm like, why are you like this? When I was in Charlotte Roos, I was like, you know what? I'll just try some on just so I can prove to myself I don't look good in them and I liked them. And off the shoulder tops, like I feel like I could possibly get dress coded for these but I can just like pop the sleeves up really quickly and then when the teacher walks away, just pull them back down. I got this white and black one. It's very like flouncy and very pretty. I got this in a size small because I felt like the medium was just too big on me. Like it just made me look bulkier so I got it in a smaller size and I think it's really pretty and just super feminine and girly. This one is so soft. I got this in a size extra small because I just really didn't like how the medium or the small looked to me. Like I said, I'm normally a medium or a small. Like I'm like right in between. But I got an extra small on this one and it's a super pretty pink. Like I said, I don't know what these are called. Like holes at the bottom and they're scalloping and it's so soft. Like it feels like velvet kind of. Like I just want to like pet it. I think I want to wear this on the first day of school. By the time this video goes up, I will have already started school. But I think this is what I'm going to wear. I think it's really pretty and totally my style. I like said that really fast because I had a burp and I didn't want to burp while I was saying it. From Loft. This is a store my mom shops at but they had 50% off everything. I really like that store because you find a lot of super cute clothes that's also like school appropriate because it's like an adult store. I like going there just because I can always find things that are school appropriate. I got this really pretty gray t-shirt that has like these kind of like lines in it. I don't know. I feel like there's a name for this but I don't really know what it is. And in the back it's a like cream chiffon. I just think it's so pretty and I really really like it. I got something that is periwinkle because like you guys said it's my color. So thank you for everyone telling me that it's my color. I really appreciate it. So it's just a simple top. It's like chiffon in the front and the back. It's more cloth and then it has a little keyhole kind of thing and I think it's really pretty. Next up we have American Eagle. They had shorts that were buy one get one 50% off and they were still really expensive but my theory is I still own American Eagle shorts that I've gotten in freshman year and I'm gonna be a senior so I feel like if I can spend a little bit more money and have something for like four or five years then it's worth it. So I got this pair of light wash high rise shorts. They have a little bit of distressing and at the bottom they have some lace. I don't really own too many light wash shorts so I really wanted to get some. The next thing I got are these high rise, la, 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 what am I saying? These high rise kind of like, they're not dark wash, it's kind of like just blue distressed shorts. These ones are a little short, like I wore these to the Khalid concert with the black shirt, they're a little short. My theory is I could just roll these down like a little bit right here and it will look nice on me. Last store, we're almost done, thank goodness it's getting really hot in here. It's getting hot in here. I went to H&M and I got three things that are all the same thing in different colors. It's a total me thing to do. So I got three t-shirt dresses. My friend Sam has H&M t-shirt dresses and I'm like always in love with them. Like they just, they look really nice on her. So I wanted to get some for myself and copy her. And they were $9.99. So I was like, this is an amazing deal. They're always $9.99, but I was just like, this is a really great price and they look really great on. So I got three different colors because t-shirt dresses are so nice for when you're running late and you don't have time to like match an outfit or think about wearing pants. And you can totally dress them up or down if you have like a necklace and the right pair of shoes. They can look super fancy or you can totally just wear them casual. So this one is a white and black striped dress. I think it's really pretty and super cute. I love stripes. Definitely love this one. I got this. It's kind of like a mixture between navy and royal blue. It's like a dark royal blue. It's really pretty. This one is just one of my faves. And then I kind of got this like grayish blue. Like it's kind of like a dirty blue. Like not necessarily dirty. Like it's just, it looks more casual and it's really pretty. I got these all in a size small. Medium had a better length on me, but it was also just like super like bulky and baggy up front. So I liked the small and this one right here smells like sweat because I wore it yesterday and I was sweating a lot yesterday. <laughs> I'm also sweating a lot right now because all these studio lights. So that was my haul. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and let me know if you want me to do more hauls. If you want me to, I can, but I probably won't be shopping as much because I do I got a lot of clothes here. And don't forget to enter the giveaway in the description and my back to school giveaway, which is two huge prizes. So yeah, I love you guys. So much and I will see you in my next video. Bye!